Chicago will always be special because that's where it all started. And every time we're back there, that connection is real. Yes, we are wrapping up Chuck's Big Adventure in Chicago with Chicago. Chicago. The band <laughs> performed at Ruoff Music Center in Noblesville last month, and then Chuck got the, uh, in, the opportunity to sit down before that yeah. show. That had to have been a thrill for you. What's your favorite Chicago song? Um, Saturday in the Park. Carlos? Oh, my gosh. Uh, I'll tell you after the after the piece. Okay, <laughs> sorry. You're the, inspiration. You're, the You're inspiration. the inspiration. You're the inspiration. You're the inspiration. Well, there are 46 of them, and let me tell you, it was a thrill of a lifetime to interview Chicago. Over 100 million records sold in their 54-year career, and even though the three remaining founders are well into their 70s, there is nothing stopping them. What would Chuck's big adventure about Chicago be without? Chicago. So, Lee Lochnane, Robert Lamb, Jimmy Panko, thank you so much. It's a pleasure. Thanks for having us. And by the way, congratulations. Apparently, you did what Ponce de Leon did, and you found the fountain of youth. <laughs> uh, you, guys, you guys look great. Is it the music that keeps you young? Partially that, partially having uh, children and traveling around the country and, you know, we're moving around like we're 20 years old and uh, we have to act like it as well. I mean, a year and a half where people had basically nothing to do and now they're going to your shows. Do you see that release of, or relief in them? Oh, absolutely. Oh, yeah. it's, it's very touching. <laughs> get a kind of lump in your throat uh, when, when you first look out on stage and people are so happy. They're happy to be at a concert. They're happy yeah. to be anywhere <laughs> yeah. at home. And I know, yes I know that it's plain to see. You guys together, the three of you, 54 years. Is there a secret to having this relationship? No, communication. The first day we got together and played, we liked what it sounded like and that really hasn't changed. There is a famous rock singer that you guys actually have toured with who I heard say as bands get older and you bring new people in, most of the time the musicianship increases. Do you guys do see that? That's yeah. true, yep. Younger musicians bring uh, an advanced knowledge of pop music. And they help you to up your game. Well, yeah, yeah or, or they're able to keep up with us. Yeah, there, there, there you go. Because the, <laughs> the music that has come through us has, never, has not gotten any easier right. today than it was the day it was written and recorded. So you have to keep your chops together just to uh, keep up. Yeah, it's challenging. Yeah. Yeah, but it's great. What do the next three to five years look like for Chicago? Well, if you ask our manager, we're going to be working in five years. So yeah. nothing's going to change. Yeah, we're going to do it much. until we can't do it anymore. Until, well, for me, until it's not believable anymore. I mean, I don't want to get to the point where I'm struggling to climb on the stage. I mean, we have been very blessed. We're healthy, and as long as we can do it believably, we're going to be doing it, man. It sounds good to us. People are enjoying it. There's no reason to stop. And you look out there, man, and you see these faces, and you just, yeah! I'll never get sick of it, ever. Come on! <laughs> Woo! <That was laughs> they fun. aren't stopping anytime soon. One of the things we learned in our interview is that BMG Records has now signed them to not a one record off deal, but a two record deal for three guys and their wonderful band, and they're in their 70s. Well, I've got more with my interview sh from Chicago at WTHR.com slash Chuck's Big Adventure. If you like what you saw, you're going to love We're showing the whole interview That's on our digital platforms. And by the way, I want to thank our crew for a wonderfully fun mm -hmm. Chuck's Big Adventure. Producer Megan Simpson, Scott Graber, who was with us on this trip. And that piece uh, shot and edited by the great Steve Rhodes. So 
thanks to all of our crew. By the way, we could not have done this Chicago band without uh, the help and assistance of the people at Live Nation and the greatest agent slash manager in the world, Peter Schiaparelli. <laughs> well, <laughs> well, I tell you what, you know, I, I say this is your best big adventure because oh, thank you, you, you see the heart that you have in it. You love Chicago, yeah. you know, not only the band, but also the city. That And if you, you want to go online, you got it. If you missed any of the things you saw uh, that you, this week, go out to WTHR.com slash Chuck's, Chuck's big, 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 big Adventure. Big adventure.